Introduced way back in Forsaken, Oathkeeper is a pair of exotic hunter gauntlets that I personally never choose because holding a bow infinitely never was appealing to begin with. So with Season of the Deep, Bungie gave them a buff and I want to read over the perk and do a proper test to see how these things work. Starting with the perk, Adamantine Brace, bow charges can be held indefinitely, gain a bonus to the bow's damage when released based on how long the charge was held provides a moderate benefit to the airborne effectiveness stat of bows. So when you have the exotic equipped and you draw a bow on the left side of the screen, you'll see a buff called Adamantine Brace. And think of this as a charge level that is split into about four sections. When you're at the first section or basically level zero, you gain no buff. But once you cross the first threshold of the charge level, you'll gain a bonus to your damage. And it goes all the way up until you max out the charge level. So level one is roughly a 38-39% increase. Level two is a 75% increase. Level three is about a 112% increase. And max level is, or max charge is at 150% increase. And uh, forgive me if you prefer decimals over percentages, but that's how I do the mathematics. So uh, I also tested it with Leviathan's Breath and it does not gain a bonus damage, which is a huge shame and i also want to test with lemon arc or lemon arc to see if the poison damage would gain a bonus damage as well at each charge level which it does not and the last test i did was with wish ender to see if the re-entry damage would gain a bonus damage as well it does not Overall, I would say this is a pretty decent change considering where the exotics were before the buffs. Uh, free bonus damage to your bow never hurts and it kind of comes down to do you want more total damage or higher DPS? Granted, I'd be curious if someone did some actual damage numbers to see if this is a better DPS weapon overall, but considering you have to hold the charge for about a few seconds to get the max damage out of the exotics, who knows, but I'm gonna go ahead and end it here and I'll see you guys in the next one.